I went to rewire this and I copped it up. Okay. Because um, I did do CNG uh, part one electrical install years and years ago, so I overestimated, overestimated okay. my memory. That's something I've never seen. I've never seen a switch mod like that. Common, one way at the top, loop, two way. Never seen a switch like that before. I've just arrived at a job where um, I got the lady wants some light fittings put up. I kept, when I came to have a look at it the other day, she, she did mention she had a qualification in electrical. I don't know what sort of qualification. And I think she tried to do some switches and she's ended up with no lights. So I've got, to so that's why I've come around now to try and fix that, sort that out. And then I'll come back another day and do the light fittings because I won't be able to do them now. It's a bit late. So hopefully I'll go in there and film it and um, you can see. Thanks for watching. Bye. I went to rewire this and I copped it up. Okay. Because <laughs> um, I did do CNG uh, part one electrical install years and years ago. So I overestimated, overestimated okay. my memory. Okay. Um, so at the minute, that this light on, this switch on the left works fine. Yeah. It turns the light on. Yeah. When you turn it off, it blows all the fuses. So clearly I cocked something up. Okay. And this this one controls the light that's just under that arch there. All right. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. yeah and okay. that doesn't turn on at all. So. I told you about to open, sorry. Okay. Um, right. I called right. it a professional because I've used it. And the fuse board's here. And All right, then, okay. You've got a new fuse board. Yeah, I think, well, it, I it's, think plastic, it's done like. It's eight, plastic. I think it's all right. It's like now. eight, ten years ago. It's and cool. I have a new light for here, and if you get time to do it, it's great. And if you don't, do okay. For the kitchen. Okay. Here, yeah. And this one, which is like a, I don't know, one of them ones. Um, just to get those. Just, uh, on the, uh, I, just, I just sprayed them all with. Oh, they are. And then you've got. Um, I've got like a pendant for the, for the hallway there. Oh, yeah. There's nothing wrong with that one, as far as I know. Okay, but, cool. Yeah. Let's connect it there. See what it can do. That black and that red. That's phase and switch line for the light up there. So when I connect it to one of those switches, that should work. Right, I've connected the, um, the switch line and the phase and the switch line. That should be have red sleeving or brown sleeving on it. So now, right, so that light's working. Um, the client says she didn't do this connection here. So I'm assuming that these two, that... I'm assuming that these two red cables here, if I connect them into the other switch, that light should come on. That light there should come on. That's something I've never seen. I've never seen a switch marked like that. Common, one way at the top, loop, two way. Never seen a switch like that before. I suppose this must be um, some sort of, you could use this as an intermediate as well. Because I was looking down the bottom for one way next to the two way. So I had to have a good look and there is one way at the top. <laughs> Come across things every day that you don't know, no matter how long you've been in this business. So I've confirmed that this one and that one goes to, the, goes to that light up there, right? And up here, we've only got two cables, right? But another thing is, this is one mil. Yep, this is one mil as well, so it hasn't changed. There's no junction. Okay, so I confirm that this one and this one goes up there. So one is the neutral, this is the neutral, so that's got to go with there. Now, once you Power, put power to this one, it should, that one should light up, but it's not. This one here, I don't know what it is. I was thinking it would be another light, but it's not. So I um, just have to look into it a bit more, see if I can sort it. Uh, we put that fitting up. Okay. It's always up, okay. but the Fitting's bulb is... Charge me. Bulb is flickering. That one's working. It works there, but when you put the lamp in, it's flickering. We have to look into that later. The fault with the switch. Um, I should sort that out a lot quicker. After I, what, after I 
did sort it. I thought, oh, that I should have done that a lot quicker, actually. Because um, it's only live and neutral going up to the switch. And then I think my my flute tester, the little, um, the one that I continuity tester, I think that's playing up because I use my um, other tester. Um, what's that one? Uh, oh God, I can't remember, but I use that. And I think that's, I've, I've noticed on a few jobs, I think that te that flute tester is a bit dodgy. Um, anyway, it's sorted out now. It um, I tested it with the tester. She switched off the switch. The tester went off. So it should do the same for the light. Got the light up. It was a bit of a struggle. Um, the connections all right. Got it up. She gave me a lamp from another fitting because I don't think she bought a lamp with the fitting. It's one of those thin screwing lamps, you know. So I screwed it in, but it wouldn't work. So she gave me another one out of another lamp, put that in. That worked. It switched on and off, but the light was just flickering. It's like when you try to dim LED lights, sometimes they flicker. This one, just as soon as it, you turn on the light, it just flickered, 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 and it's not on a dimmer. So she was in a rush to get out because she had to go and pick up her turkey. So um, I couldn't get to look at it any further. So maybe I'll have to come back here after Christmas. Or she said she was going to get another lamp. I said to send me the paperwork so I can have a look at it. Just in case there's anything in it that tells you any special lamp or whatever. I doubt it. I don't know. Hopefully I can look at it in the new year and get that sorted. Or she buys a new lamp, put it in and it works perfectly. Okay, so it switches on and off, so I can't see what's causing it. So anyway, just want to say thanks to everybody who's been watching the videos and growing the channel to 10,000. <laughs> oh my gosh, I didn't think you'd ever get 10,000. It's all down to Omari though. He edits the videos, put them up, deals with the website. Everything on that side is all to do with Omari. So it's, he knows what he's doing. So if you want to grow your business, any business, no, don't have to be electrical or building. Get all the Bomari, contact him. He'll do you a good job. He's really good. Um, and um, hope all you guys pick up something from the videos, especially the young Sparkies. You know, don't rush your work. Take your time. Get it done right first time. The more you do things, the quicker you get. You know, if you remember the first time you connected the socket, stripped the cables connected, probably took you ages. But now you do it in no time. So it's just a matter of experience. The more you do things, the quicker you get. So you don't want to rush and do things wrong, not connect things properly or stuff like that. Okay.